I play Matilda, and she is the teacher at the Infinity Acceptance Group, which is basically an anger management kind of zen oasis. And uh, she has the luxury of working with several of uh, the most uh, angry birds that are on the island. My character is a real fun lady. She's a she's a big old chicken, and she has uh, these sort of these sort of beautiful eyelashes, and she's kind of giggly and bubbly, and nothing really nothing really stops her. She's she's having her own party, pretty much twenty four seven, and even though things can kind of get her down, she's got her her zen sort of inner qualities that allow her to really have as much patience as possible, which is needed, uh, especially within the group that she's working with. When I came on to do the movie, there were so many funny people involved that I knew it was going to be hilarious. and. Um, and some of the people in it that I know well and I know their voices already sort of automatically brought it to life in my head of what, you know, knowing that, that Jason was going to be read, I could, you know, I know his voice so well. So I know his sense of humor and the way that he plays lines in this way that I, 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 I understood what kind of movie was, was being made and, um, so it's exciting, it's just, and it's exciting to be, when you, when you hear all these names, it's exciting to be recruited into that group, you know? There are all kinds of ways to diffuse anger. My character, Matilda, might suggest using yoga. And, you know, she's got a lot of breathing poses. I'm sure she'd probably have one called Sitting Duck where she would fold her legs and sit like a duck and then just breathe. Just like a duck breathes. It'll make you feel really good. My character Matilda definitely you know, spreads the joy and the love and all the positivity, but there is definitely an undercurrent of just hanging on by a thread maybe that maybe she really needs this anger management practice as well, that I think maybe deep down we're all, we're all trying to stay calm under the surface. Did you know that filming on The Hunger Games Catching Fire left Jennifer Lawrence temporarily deaf in one ear? Hmm, sorry, what's that you said? For this and more movie facts, click on more videos. But if you want something else, click on the playlist.